for today when it comes to the Real Housewives of Atlanta. Now, I wanted to talk to you guys about Kyle and Mauricio quickly. So I don't know what's going on on that front. That's another scandal. Kyle and Mauricio, they were separating. Then Kyle came back and released like a joint statement with Mauricio to say they are not divorcing, that they're very much still together and not to believe the rumors. And then we see them kind of like together eating or just spending time. But now it is, it has been confirmed that they're actually really separating. So I don't know, like I think, how long were they together for? Like I think 27 years, that's like a lifetime together. And they have like how many children? Like, I don't know, like it seems, you know, it seems very sad. And to tell you the truth, from the first season of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, there has been allegations against Mauricio. Even Camille, when she was talking, like, you know, at the dinner, um, how, how was that called, that episode? The, um, the dinner from hell. Anyways, like something from hell, right? So when the ladies left and uh, Camille <laughs> was just there with her friend Didi and Alison Dubois, she was saying, oh, we know that he likes the ladies. And she kind of made a face, right? So those rumors have always been there. And at first I was just like, you know, those people, they're in the public eye. They're in Beverly Hills. Like they're living like the, the fast life and all of that. So people are always going to have something to say. Women are always going to come and say, oh, yes, you know, I was with Mauricio or this person or that celebrity. But I was always wondering you know, men, like in general, they're not that responsible when it comes to, you know, you know what I'm talking about. So I was thinking, I don't know, like this guy seems to be like every week they're saying like Mauricio's cheating with this person. Like when he's going to this town, he has that person, that town, that person. And I was just like, it's impossible that Mauricio, if he is in fact doing all of this cheating, that he is being responsible with every single woman that he encounters. You know what I mean, right? And I was just like, I'm surprised that there's no love child that has, you know, come out of all of these like extracurricular <laughs> or extramarital affairs, right? So I don't know. I'm wondering what you guys think about that, but I definitely think that it is sad that Kyle and Mauricio, and I'm not a, a Kyle fa fan. I've said this multiple times. Um, there's a lot of housewives sometimes that, you know, you don't like at the beginning and then they grow on you, right? For example, for me anyways, like, you know, Dorit, her first season, I didn't really like her. Second season, I liked her a little more, more, but not so much. But now, like, Dorit is, like, one of my favorite on that show. I actually like Dorit quite a bit. And, uh, you know, Melissa is another one. Like, I didn't like Melissa for at least four seasons. And then now I actually liked her um quite a bit last season, but I started liking her only like at the end of season six, season seven, that's when I started liking Melissa, right? But not above Teresa still, but now I do. This season, I liked Melissa more than I liked Teresa. So anyways, and um, Kyle, for me, she has never grown on me. Like from the time that Kyle has been on that show, I have never liked her at, at I don't like okay mind you I think she is good for the show okay and I do not want to see Kyle fired I'm just saying I don't identify with Kyle at all like her character on the show is just not for me and every season I want to be open to liking her I just don't right I just don't but I don't want her to lose her job and I think she still brings a lot to the show that's my opinion right um I was more of a who do I like on that show on Beverly Hills when she was there? Of course, I like Lisa Vanderpump when she was on the show. I think she was funny and hysterical. And I did like their little friendship together. I, I, I find that Kyle and her girlfriends, she has good girlfriend relationships. So that's one thing about her that I will give her, right? Oh, and the whole thing about that, that girl or what's her name? Like um, Mo. That, anyways, the country singer, I don't know, like, I don't know if there's really something there. Like, like I said, I find that Kyle, she tends to get really close with her girlfriends. Like, even when she was with Teddy, like, and Teddy was on the show, she's like super close to her. She's very close to Faye Resnick. And, and she's very defensive of those relationships as well, right? So I don't know, she might just be like, 
you know, going through, um, like a very like imp like you know like a hard time in her life right now and maybe that's the friendship that she needs but for the rest i don't know like i'm not going to speculate on that but i just don't see